What is happening, guys? Calway here, and we are back with more of The Witcher 3 for you. So, obviously, quite a few changes since the last episode. As you can see, we have 45,000 crowns at this point. Did quite a bit of that shell trick to make a hefty sum of money. Uh, additionally, we took care of respecking. And I switched it around a couple times, and this is ultimately what I settled on with what I had available. So, we, have, uh, we still have the five points here in muscle memory. We also got one point for now in Precise Blows, and then we put three points into Strength Training. So uh, basically, you know, I needed eight points to advance to the second tier, and as much as I liked the idea of doing an adrenaline-based, like, uh, build, you know, basically until later, I don't really feel it'll be viable, you know? Like, our, our adrenaline gain is still very low. With a bunch of points, it could be amazing, but until then, I figured it'd be better to you know, work with my strengths, my, my fast attacks, my strong attacks. So having all three of those plus the gem, we got the 20% attack power. And then as for the signs, I picked up two in Axie. I haven't seen anyone need level three Axie, so that gives me... And then with a greater blue mutagen, giving me a 30% sign intensity. So, of course, we gave up all the general stuff, you know, Sun and Stars, Focus, Adrenaline Burst. Um, I think we had, what was it, Battle Trance or something? I don't know. But, you know, at the end of the day, I felt like I just wasn't really getting the worth out of those for now. So, either way, we're going to take on a contract here. Greetings. Yeah? Heard you have a problem, a monster you call a Shrieker. Oi, prowls about it does. Snatches cows and goats mostly, but it won't scorn a man if it runs into one. Borzoi, huntsman under the old lord, well he said enough's enough. Claimed he'd put a stop to it, drive the beast away. Mm -hmm. Took a hatchet. Laid an ambush for the shrieker beyond the moat, where the fields start. It's where we found him. Guts stretched o'er the crowd in a tree like gossamer. Took half a day to collect the parts. Put them in a grave. Yeah, let's do a little negotiating. I know times are tough, but I'll need you to cough up a bit more coin. Say... 260? I suppose I can add that. Ye are risking your neck for us. Sounds good. High time a professional took a look at this shrieker. Anyone around here know more about the beast? Borzoi's son Simcoe does. Saw the aura with his own eyes. But you might find the lad art to chat with. Still mourns his father, methinks. I see. Where'll I find him? At my homestead. I took the tyke in when he lost his dad. The mother passed long ago. Hey buddy, is this... he's outside. Ah, uh, oil and linen. I like how I have all this money, yet I'm still just, you know, everything I find, I'm still like, yep, gotta take this, gotta take this, gotta take this. Just because you have money doesn't mean you stop raiding houses. Why can't I have that? Looks like he's behind the house, though, so we're gonna swing around back here. Hey buddy, what you doing? Why did I just climb on the roof? Can we talk? Let me be. Calm down, I just wanna... Go, I said. I wanna avenge your father, but to do that I gotta know what killed him. Shrieker killed him. Don't you know? That name doesn't mean much to me. Describe the beast. Tell me what it looked like. Something like a rooster, but huge, with a lizard's tail. Chimera? Heard Ruffler barking in the woods. Ran to see what you were on about. There were Dad, in the bushes. A hole through his belly. And he were moaning, screaming. I wanted to help, but how could I? How? Shush now. Calm. Calm. Take care, kid. That axie is already paying off, man. 
going to get nice uh, little bits of experience every time I do that. I'm curious to see what this thing is, though. You know, considering it looked like a rooster with the tail of a lizard and it punched a hole through the kid's father's stomach. Like, it's got to be a... To me, at least, that sounds like a chimera of some sorts. I don't know if there's chimeras in The Witcher, but we're going to find out. And I am excited to see what Igni can do with his upgrades. Ow! right across the marshland here. It's not too far. Just in case, let's put Quinn up. Getting nothing here. There we go. Tracks are irregular here. Monster must have started staggering. Was wounded most likely. Big tracks, though. Blood. Monster blood. enhanced right now in armor and weapons so we're going into this pretty well prepared lead to the cave let's save real fast just because we don't know what it is last thing I need is to go down Take a cat potion. Sounds coming from above. No way to get up there, though. Huh? That makes sense. Oh, that would be why I don't have any bombs equipped. Shot. This one's the blinding one. Let's put that on the bottom slot. Damn it, it's not here. Must have fled through another exit. Gotta nab it before it gets away. I want to kill off my cat potion. There is things. Won't get away this time. I don't know if I have anything for a cockatrice in my bestiary. Take a look, though. Here we go. Vulnerable against... Do sign. Ard. My Ard is not upgraded. Pretty sure I have cursed. Really? Well, whatever. Fuck it if it works. Kind of want a clear cat. This. Yes. 
What now? Shit. That's my bomb. Ooh, that fucks it up. Even if it's not the most effective, if it's something that likes to fly, chances are it hates fire. Down you go. What the hell was that? Monster brain, cockatrice stomach, cockatrice egg, cockatrice mutagen, dwarven axe, it's a relic, smoking pipe skull, and a cockatrice trophy. Not too shabby. Trophy time. Not a bad contract. So I am curious what a uh, cockatrice mutagen can do. What like tier it's considered. Oh, it's only a 5%. Garbage. Let's check out that trophy though. 5% bonus experience for humans and non-human. Versus... Oh. Never mind, it's just the 10% chance to dismember. The Noon Wraith is the 5% bonus for humans. I, I sold the Griffin Head one, the 10% chance. Um, yeah, I think I'll keep the Noon Wraith on. I mean, I don't, you know. Dismember is like combat flavor, but it's not necessary. I mean, I guess, maybe dismemberment counts towards like instant kill. Why can't you, why can't you gallop? Why can't you sprint right now? Oh, you know what? I wonder. I just put saddlebags on him. I wonder if that affected his, his gallop rate. Go, go. I think it does. We're going to find out, though, real fast here. No, maybe my horse is just bugged right now. That's odd. I don't know why he's not sprinting. Either way, let's put the saddlebags back on. Whoa! Gotta say, Shrieker was uh, not as bad as I thought he would be. Went down pretty easily. It's a retarded way to get back. I should've just swam across the damn thing. Horse race? Not right now. Considering my horse isn't in the mood to gallop, last thing I need is a horse race. Why do I not have sprint available? It's really bothering me. Is this the. Oh no, that's like a broken engine.
Either way you go, guys. Shrieker is down. So, um, real quick, just because I know we're about to wrap up this one. Take a look at the quests. Obviously, we picked up a ton of quests while we were over in Novigrad. Um, you know, Defender of the Faith and Fist of Fury. I think that's the Fight Club style quest. There's a bunch of little quests here. You know, the Counterfeit Papers, Visit the Soothsayer, Races. So, level-wise, we could still do Wild at Heart. Um, of Dairy and Darkness. That's the quest we picked up while we were out in Novigrad. Same with Follow the Thread. Volunteer, I think, was another one. Yeah, near Oxenfurt. Those were not even touching. Witcher contract-wise, we got a level 12. We got a level 10. So some of these will be coming up pretty soon. And as for treasure hunts, of course, we got the Griffin School Gear quest approaching very, very close. So likely we're going to turn this one in and then... I would imagine we'll probably knock out Wild at Heart just because I do like hitting everything. I mean, obviously, there's some content we're not going to do. Like, you know, I'm not going to play the Baron for a rare Gwent card. I mean, I might, but that's not really something I need to record. But, um, yeah. So we'll probably knock that out. And then after that, we'll pretty much cleaned up just about everything. And we'll be on our way with the, the main quest again. Yeah? Shrieker won't trouble you anymore. Thank you, Master Witcher. Your reward ain't much, but as they say, take care of the pennies. You know, I don't really need the money. Keep the coin. You took in an orphan. Need it more than I do. And they call witches unfeeling. Inhuman. Well, I thank ye. From the bottom of my heart. Damn, 250 experience. Shrieker is down. And I got 45,000 right now. I don't I don't need the coin. Let him take care of the kid, you know. Wonder if I get more experience for doing that. Level 9. So yeah, we're definitely up. <laughs> Ladies of the Wood is not going to be hard. Either way, like I said, Wild at Heart is going to be tackled next. So, with that in mind, make sure to stay tuned and we'll catch you guys in a little bit as we take on our next quest.